Okay. Hey, everybody. Good morning. Hey, we're uh, we're here to do another of the 10 benefits of 7K medals. So today's episode is going to be about this incredible thing that you're seeing. You're going to be seeing here on the or you're probably seeing it right now on the on the screen. Uh, a place called Stack and Sell. It's the marketplace because people that buy gold and silver and things like that and are do things like this, they wonder, how am I going to get my money out? How am I, you know, okay, great. I've got this gold and silver coin sitting on my desk. What do I do with it? How do I turn it into real money without losing money, uh, without it costing me a bunch of time and, and all that kind of stuff and having to keep track of it all. So anyway, we have our brother Sean Palmer here today, and he's going to show us how this all works and how incredible it is. And this is going to be a super exciting episode today. So, Sean, get after it. Let's let's do some stack and sell, baby. All right, let's do it. Uh, so, yeah, stack and sell is a very exciting part of the 7K business. It is a completely different company that was developed specifically for us members but it was developed by the leaders of the 7K business. And what they realized is that a lot of people, even though they're saving and collecting money every month on autopilot, which makes saving money the easiest it could ever be. And that's the main thing that for me is the number one reason to get into 7K. Um, I tried to save money in different times of my life. Even when I was making good money, I tried to save money and it was just really difficult. I'd save some money, something would come up, and then most of my savings would be gone. And at the 50-year mark, I had saved literally no money in bank account. Uh, everything I had was in assets. Well, keep oh, hold on a second, Sean. I got to interrupt you. I apologize. But we want to bring it to people's attention that that money that you're saving in the bank, you're not saving that money. <laughs> that money's caught that money's losing its value every day so well not only you know, is it putting money, money in the bank is the worst way to, to save not it's only are you losing way. that money but it's easy to spend because it's right there if you need right, something right. you just go spend it but when you right. get a silver coin you can't go buy groceries with the silver coin you can't go you know spend money on frivolous stuff with silver collectible coins you have to liquidate those and if you go to your local coin dealer, like here in Billings, a uh, $150 coin, because they're used to dealing with older coins and they know nothing about these newer, higher technology, new minted coins that are, are very rare and precious and go up in value immediately, they know nothing about these. And you go in and take in one of these collectible coins worth $150, they're gonna offer you $30 for the value of the silver. Well, it's not bullion. Why would you liquidate it at bullion price? Well, because there's nowhere else to liquidate it. That's why. And yeah. so people were getting desperate and going and selling a $100 coin for $30 and taking a $70 loss. Well, it didn't take them long before they dropped out of 7K because they, they felt like they were being ripped off. Well, they were. They're being ripped off by their local coin dealer. Well, now with the marketplace that you see here with our stack and sell, this now gives the autonomy to every single collector, whether you've got one coin or a thousand coins. If you get to a point where you're, there's a bump in the road and you need some cash now, well, you don't have to go to the pawn shop. You don't have to go borrow money. You have your retirement. You have savings now that you're collecting each and every month. And so I managed to save in the last five years, the worst five years of my life, uh, almost $70,000 by just getting a coin or a couple coins each month and putting it on the side. Um, and I also have run into some jams and needed some money, but I was not going to run down to the dealer and take a $70 loss on a hundred dollar coin. So I suffered. Well, four years after the introduction of 7k metals and collecting coins and putting your savings on autopilot, they developed stack and sell. And what that was, was the solution to eBay because eBay has been your alternative if you wanted to liquidate some of your collectibles for market value and not run down to a dealer and get ripped off for what he tells you he thinks it's worth so that he can put it back on the shelf for a hundred bucks and put $70 in his pocket. 
So the fact that the company developed this stack and sell specifically for us uh, allows us that freedom that if we do need to get into our savings, as painful as that is, at least you're not going to lose 70% of your investment to try and get some cash in your pocket to pay some bills. You can go on the stack and sell marketplace, list a coin, and my first coin that sold, sold within an hour of being put on stack and sell. And it's about a two or three day verification process. Now, what I mean by that is with the old uh, eBay method, you're liable. You're liable for fraud. You're liable for getting ripped off. Uh, you can send money to buy a coin and maybe they're going to send you a fake coin. And then what are you going to do about it when it came from China? You know, if it's in another country, uh, good luck trying to get your money back. So there was a lot of fraud taking place um, on eBay. And eBay was even threatening to quit doing coin sales because the fraud was becoming so rampant. Well, so the owners of 7K saw this niche in the marketplace that was needed. There needed to be a place where people could safely buy and sell coins without the risk of getting burned. And so they developed Stack and Sell. And so what Stack and Sell does is it alleviates all of the problems from trying to market on eBay. First of all, if I sell a coin on eBay to somebody, um, they have to find out my address to send me the money. And then I have to find that to get their address in order to ship them the coin. Well, what's to keep that person from coming and breaking into your house once they realize you're a coin dealer and they know where you live? especially if they live close by. Well, with Stack and Sell, every time that I sell a coin, I list it on Stack and Sell. When a person buys that, which is another 7K member right now, I now have the opportunity to liquidate that coin completely hassle-free, fraud-free, and I'm completely protected because I'm going to send that coin to Stack and Sell. They're going to verify that coin, and then they're the ones that are going to send it on to the actual purchaser. They're going to get the funds from the purchaser once the coin's been verified. Once those funds get transferred uh, through the Sound Money Wallet, which we'll talk about next week, uh, goes into the account, <clears throat> then they will go ahead and send the coin off to the guy who paid for it. And then those funds are then available to you, the seller, immediately, and it goes right into your uh, Sound Money Wallet. So it's an instant deposit. So it's pretty, pretty nifty the way that they've developed this stack and sell. It's a safety net for every single 7K member. We no longer have to worry about how do I sell one or two coins uh, as quickly as I can for you know, necessary cash that I need to pay bills without getting ripped off by the local coin dealer. And so this is just one of the most mm -hmm. wonderful things that 7K has developed in the five years that they've been in business. And once again, this was developed, why? For us, it's, it's a safety net for us so that we're protected. We don't have to liquidate coins uh, just because it's not that easy to go buy groceries with a coin. And so you have to liquidate it and transfer it into spendable cash somehow. Now with the Sound Money Wallet, which we'll talk about next week, there will be a credit card coming that will be linked to your sound money wallet. And as soon as that money is transferred in there, you'll actually be able to, to spend it immediately with your credit card towards gas, food, uh, eating out, whatever purchases you might have or want or need. Um, back to the stack and sell. So I got one question for you first. Yes, sir. Uh, there's always a 20% commission on eBay that you will pay. Oh, and it's 5% with stack and sell. Yeah. So there you go. And then you're saving 15% of uh, administration fees or marketing fees to liquidate your stuff. So also, once again, also uh, with eBay, it's kind of like real estate. Your, your coin will sell with the last one sold for. Otherwise, it'll just sit there. So it takes a real collector to, to make it move. Otherwise, uh, it, stuff is is marked at what the last thing sold for on eBay. So it's not a good, it's not really a good place to be, you know, getting rid of your, your coins anyhow. So. 
That's a good point, Leonard. Um, so if we look at the marketplace, um, you can see that Stack and Sell has literally hundreds, probably up to a thousand or more coins now and all different kinds of coins. Um, most of these, of course, are all 7K coins. Um, this is uh, an example of the first coin that I sold on Sunday was this Oregon Crab coin. Uh, which I sold it for, you know, what I paid for it. But, you know, I'm getting all of my money back minus $6 in shipping charges. So um, that doesn't bother me at all. And I don't liquidate coins very often uh, unless I really, really need the money. Otherwise, they're going to stay in my portfolio for the long term because these are only going to go up more and more in value all the time. So you can make long-term money by investing in coins and you can also make short-term money by investing and then flipping those coins right away. And it's not very hard to pick up a coin on stack and sell with instant equity. Let's take a look. Um, right here, instant equity. You see that legacy of the pharaohs? This is a three ounce coin. Let's click on it. You can see that the market value for this coin is $740, but you can pick it up for 680. So if I wanted to buy this coin today for 680, then I could turn around and put it back on the market for say $10 over market value, 750 and make almost $100 just like that. And so there's lots and lots of opportunities if you have the investment capital to spend just five minutes a day, maybe 10 minutes a day going through the stack and sell collection. And you can see there's lots of coins. There's another one, instant equity. There's another one, instant equity. So look at how many coins on any given day, you can go to stack and sell and you can literally pick these coins up for less than the person who bought them from 7K or cheaper than what you could get them yourself from 7K. So once again, here's another just a wonderful resource, stack and sell, because not only can you get these collectible coins shipped directly to you from 7K, but if you're missing coins here and there, you can go pick those up on stack and sell and you might get lucky and pick it up for even less than what you could have bought it if you would have got it through the company. So there's some pretty amazing deals on here. Um, it's, uh, it's one of the most wonderful things that, that 7K leadership could have done for us as the representatives, as the people that are out uh, sharing the word of precious metals and how important it is to try and protect you and your family from the declining value of fiat currency, which is paper money. And it's losing more and more value every day. They printed more paper in the last two years than you know the entire history of the country. And that is why we're seeing astronomical gas prices, food prices are skyrocketing, uh, everything's going up. And it's all because of the economy and the government and the yahoos that we have in the government right now that are trying to destroy this country and, and they're doing a very good job. And their, their end game is to make fiat currency, paper currency worthless. And then when that happens, the whole system crashes and then here comes the new world yeah. order, the one world government, one world bank. Yeah, to come rescue everybody. Yeah, exactly. And so, so that's let me really ask you something fighting. real quick while you've got that break. Um, these yeah. instant equity oh, coins, these are people, these are people that um, yeah, are uh, desperate. Yeah. Yeah. You're, you got to kind of figure, right? That they're, they, they had something come up. They hit a bump in the road. They need to, they need to liquidate. And so they're liquidating it. Um, you know, what's the old saying? My, my misfortune is your fortune or something like that. You know, right. I mean, my loss is your game. Yeah, yeah. And so um, that's why just for people who might be going, well, why is there in instant equity? I would I would guess that that's the reason why is that somebody needs the money bad. And well, of course, yeah, because if you put it on market value, it might take a while to sell. If you're willing to take a little bit of a loss. Um, that coin's probably going to sell pretty fast, and then therefore you get you get your capital back in your pocket as quickly as possible. Right now, this is cool. So uh, yeah. let me show one more thing real quick. So if you can go to my account, so I've got all of my coins now completely inventoried into my stack and sell account. 
and I can have several of those on the marketplace up for sale right now. Matter of fact, it's around eight or nine thousand dollars. But let me show you how cool this is. Let's click on my account. Let's go to my dashboard. This is going to tell you that over the last five years or so, I have invested a total of forty nine thousand eight hundred sixty three dollars, an average of about one hundred nine dollars per coin. Well, I now have a stack of 458 coins and or gold or silver notes. And the market value right now is $65,000. So over the last five years that I've been saving money and putting it aside, unlike a bank, if I were to be putting that money in a bank account, the bank isn't going to give me 30% return on my money in five years. But because I invested in silver and collectibles that appreciate very quickly, I've made a 30.4% return on my investment. So that's pretty amazing. Hooty hoo! Hooty hoo! <laughs> so we can go to completed sets. Let's take a quick look at that. How's Sean doing on his sets? Well, the seven pillars of uh, gold, the Tom Holdman uh, glass stain, beautiful pieces. Uh, I don't have all those scanned in yet. It says one, but I probably have four of the seven. Um, uh, the uh, An American Life, the Abraham Lincoln, which is a Miles Standish set of coins. And by the way, anything that Miles Standish does, folks, those are the those are the most coveted and probably the most valuable coins that are going to come through Stack and Sell, with the exception of maybe the Tiffany coin and maybe a couple others. Um, these are these are must haves for collectibles. And um, I can show you too how these uh, go up in value pretty pretty amazingly. So there's the Abraham Lincoln. Um, uh, out of the three, I, I've got um, zero uh, of the three items that are available so far for that. Hey, no, hey. I'm doing my Sorry my set that. is complete on the Benjamin Franklin. So let's look at the details. Okay, so let's see what all was involved in this set. There was nine pieces. So you can see there's a half ounce, half ounce writer, publisher, half ounce founder, half ounce firefighter, half ounce scientist, half ounce diplomat. So those were the first six series, all half ounce coins that were um, released by Miles Standish and 7K to honor Benjamin Franklin. Then came uh, the one ounce coin, actually then the two ounce coin, and then the final piece to the set was this beautiful five ounce coin of which there was only 776 of those coins ever minted. So down the road, this one coin will become worth thousands of dollars. And it's already worth over a thousand dollars right now. And this was a $699 purchase. So once again, these coins really go up pretty quickly in value. Um, let's go back to my dashboard. Um, I've got four of the George Washington series. I've got three of the Miss Liberty. Um, I've got one of the Roman Empire coins. I've got zero of the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier yet, but I will be getting those as soon as I can. And here you see I've got 27 out of the 37 state animal series coins that have been released. So I'm only 10 short of having every single coin of that complete set uh, that 7K has released. Now keep in mind that I did get the Montana, Idaho and Texas coins. Those are the hardest ones to get because they are the least in production um, and they're also the most valuable. And then I've got one of the two of the White House coins also by Miles Standish. So what's the, let's see what some of those state coins are, just so people can get an sure. idea of, of what they have the ability to. Nope, I'm glad you said that. This. So yeah, let's take a look. Um, so I'm missing the Ohio coin, the North Carolina, the Indiana, the New Jersey, the Mississippi, the Missouri, and Oklahoma. Those are the, and um, Vermont and Iowa and Arkansas. So those are the 10 coins that I'm missing out of the 37 that have been released so far. You see, I've got Alabama, New Mexico. Can you zoom South in on Carolina. some of those so people can see what they look like just sure. for the fun of it? Yeah, let's do that. Give people an idea of what they, you know, maybe they might be from South look Carolina. Look at how beautiful these coins are. Coin. 
So South Carolina, it's the loggerhead sea turtle. Look at what a beautiful coin that is. And then this also, so you know, this is a $5 coin. This is not a silver dollar. This is a $5 silver piece. So it's five times more valuable in currency than a silver eagle. Silver eagle is just a $1 denomination. So these things are pretty, pretty doggone wow. cool. That's cool. Um, let's see. Um, let's let's go check out the Montana coin and zoom in on that because the Montana coin, well, and the Idaho coin. So this Idaho coin uh, sold for one hundred and thirty nine dollars two years ago. Uh, the market value on this coin now is right at about one thousand two hundred dollars. Zoom in on that. The Idaho Appaloosa. Only 2,000 of these coins were ever produced. That should be a kayaker. <laughs> <laughs> and then let's take a look at the Montana coin. Oh, that's right. It's animals. But a kayaker is an animal. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. He really is. And so for Montana, it's not actually an animal. It's the, the state bug or the state um, butterfly which is the Montana Morning Cloak. And this is the most valuable coin in the set. Uh, one of these coins has sold for $1,800 before, for a $139 coin. So people cannot say that you can't make money with 7K medals. They're, they're talking through their hat. This is the easiest way in the world to make money. Nevada, New York, Oregon, Pennsylvania, Texas, Illinois, Kansas. So I've got all of those in my stack and sell portfolio. Pretty cool. And the, the thing is, is you're you're not only making money and saving money, but you're it's real money. Real money. And then these coins go up uh, in value all the time. Um, so you can see, let's go take a look. Where did it go? Let's check out that Utah coin. I want to okay. see that. This is the one you just got sent, brother. Seems how I got one of those coming in the mail. I want to there see that is. thing. Oh, look Rocky at that. Mountain Elk. I've seen a slew of those over my years here in the great state of Utardia. But look at all that detail, that three-dimensional uh, relief on the coin that just makes them so, they're just so beautiful. Yeah, um, and this is a Cook Island series. So uh, once again, very beautiful coins, incredible value, and and then they just go up in value so fast. It's pretty incredible. Um, the market value on some of these coins, uh, even though they just got released, um, are already higher in market value on stack and sell than when you bought them. So I mean, the minute it shows up on your doorstep. You already have instant equity. I'm trying, and here it is. This Massachusetts, I spent 139 for this, and the market value for this coin is already $220. Believe it or not, Massachusetts ladybug. So, uh, honestly, folks, there's just no way to go wrong with 7K metals. And the fact that now that we've got a stack and sell, which gives you 100% autonomy so that you can go through and liquidate some of your portfolio if you need to because you're tight on money or you can save it save it for the long haul and watch that 200 dollars coin in a year become a 500 dollars coin and then hang on to it two or three more years and then watch that coin become a thousand dollar coin so the way that these coins appreciate there's really no better investment vehicle out there period not not the stock market not investing in cars. The only thing that could probably come close is real estate, but even real estate has its ups and downs. Whereas a low minted coin is just going to continually rise in value, period. It's never going to go down in value when it's a low minted coin. That means it's scarce and it's rare. And, and um, you know, to pump in on something real quick again, um, the ability to get these coins, these these coins, you know, you can either go buy them on stack and sell or they, they, when they come out with these cool kinds of coins, they put them out through what's called a coin drop. And we're going to be going over that on one of, a, one of our future uh, 10 
planks of all the great stuff. Uh, oh, absolutely. The coin drops are once again, just another incredible feature and a benefit to being a member. And perfect example, we'll just talk about it super quick. The last coin drop that came out, well, not the last one, but probably the one before, they came out with the final piece of the three-part Pearl Harbor series. They did a one ounce, a two ounce, and then finished with this beautiful five ounce coin. That coin sold for 850. It sold out within a minute or two. And the very next day, people had it listed on stack and sell for $1,200. So instant $500 profit. And if you look at my listings that I have on stack and sell, you can see over the weekend, I just sold three coins. These two already shipped out. This one's going to get shipped out today. So, Sean, can you by chance go through really quickly and show people, because people, especially people who are in not very computer literate, they're going, oh, man, how, how much, what's this going to, I got, how much time do I have to spend to put these things on here? What, what's the process? Maybe you could give people an example of how quick and easy it is to actually list the coin that, like you just got yeah. six coins in the mail. Fan, fantastic idea. That's beautiful. Let me do just that. But before we do that, while I'm on this page, let me show you how this works. So you can see that my listing price was 150. Well, this was $139 coin. And then of course I paid shipping charges on it. So 150 is pretty much about what I own the coin for. So I liquidated it and all three of these coins, rather than going to the coin dealer and getting $30 and losing 120, I put it on stack and sell. It was gone within minutes and I got every single penny of my money back minus the $6 shipping charges. Now let's look at some of the other coins. So this Montana coin right here, um, I bought for $105 two years ago. The market value is now 450 and I have three of those in my portfolio. So I just put this one up for sale yesterday, which is why it's under review. And um, let's go do just that. Let's go to my stack. And now this is an inventory, believe it or not, of all of my coins. And the ones that have the green tag, you can see that's an item that's for sale. So let's say um, I've got, let's look for a coin in here. Uh, okay, so here's the Idaho coin that I bought for $139. The market value is now just under $1,100. Let's click on that. Let's say I want to list this for sale. Click on that. Come down. How much money do you want? Well, I want $1,200 for it. And then hit submit. How do all those coins get listed on your stack and sell? Did you have to list them or do they automatically yeah, you, get listed? No, you, you, you have to list them. Okay. And you have to do just what I did. You go through, okay. you, you find the coin you want to sell, you click on it, and then you say listed for sale. No, I'm saying how do they get in here in the first place, not where oh, they oh, sell oh, them. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I misunderstood your question. Um, you scan them in because see this barcode right here? Uh -huh. So you basically take your phone, you load up the stack and sell app, and then you're going to put add a coin here. Okay, simple. Yeah. It really is. I love it. This is so cool. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> it really honestly is. And and the sad thing is, is that I, I myself am guilty of neglecting stack and sell for the entire year that it was in the beta phase. People were saying, oh my gosh, I just listed a coin and it sold immediately. And I got the money and stack and sell so amazing. And so you, you heard all these members raving about stack and sell. And me being a dumb dumb, I just wanted to keep my money for retirement, even though I, I could use a little money for cash flow because I'm self-employed. Well, I finally realized, hey, uh, you're better off to liquidate some of your coins. Why? Because you can always buy more coins. Matter of fact, I sold three coins, but then I got six more uh, in the mail from FedEx actually uh, over the weekend. So I sold three, but then I've got six more. So don't get too attached to any one coin because you can always get another one. <laughs> that's, 
That's yeah. the main lesson that you want to learn as a collector. I love it. This is cool stuff. Um, so we're we're right at pretty much right at our half hour. Um, how do we want to finish this out? Um, what I think probably the, now see here's item for sale that I just put up. Yeah, we can click on that. And then we can say modify listing. And we can cancel that listing. There you go. So that's that what easy. you would have to do if you sold one. Once you have it, you want to. No, once, once you sell a coin, see, it goes red like this. Oh, OK. And so... then it goes down to the very bottom of history complete. So once it's sold and the money's put into your sound money wallet, uh, stack and sell automatically deducts that out of your inventory and it goes in your sold. So they keep track of everything for you for the most part. So uh, I can already would be is what we talked about earlier. If I were to sell a coin to a friend, like, like I did with you, then it's my responsibility then to come and take that coin out of inventory. So let's say hypothetically, this was the coin that I sent you. Um, and it didn't sell on stack and sell. Just go click on edit detail, cancel listing, or realistically, it would be a delete. You just delete the, the coin out of your stack and sell account. Because all this is going to do is cancel the listing. So it's not for sale, but it's still going to stay in my account. And then you're just going to go through and delete that coin uh, if you sold it to somebody other than through stack and sell. And we'll probably have to do another another little short uh, video of, for this series as to you know well we'll be doing how these, to scan um, a, a coin how to actually put one in and we can save that for another one of our you know after we get through the benefits then we'll start going deeper in and JJ all the things. that is such a great point because the thing is this the benefits from being a seven k member are basically unlimited. So sure, there's 10 major benefits, but then there's dozens of other little benefits like we were just talking about. I mean, there's dozens of little benefits just within the stack and sell. You're right, at some point in time, we're gonna be doing videos and training on all of the little microcosms under stack and sell. Sure, we can do one uh, general training on stack and sell, but then we can do one on how to list a coin, how to sell a coin, how to delete a coin. We can take people through and, and educate them on how to efficiently use their stack and sell portfolio. And the best part about the stack and sell portfolio is you have all of your coins in one place. Everything is inventory. So you got to realize for the five years that I was collecting coins, I had no idea how many coins I had. Not until I got everything um, scanned into stack and sell. Now I know I have exactly 458 coins and notes and i have a total value now of just under seventy thousand dollars have i ever saved 70 grand in my life no never uh, only in the last five years since i've started collecting coins have i been able to save any money and 70 grand is just sixty five thousand. just blows me away that i managed to save that amount of money in the worst five years of my life so i'm I, I've got a question for you. Go back to that last page that we were just on. Okay, it says right there, vault awaiting shipment. So you're shipping those coin, you ship those or or you're gonna ship those. And what's the deal with the, the shipping? Because you already talked about how they, how we have to ship the, the coins directly to stack and sell and then stack and sell sends them over to them. And so right. what's, what's their process for that? Just real quickly. So people can kind of get an idea of how much time it takes them and like, oh, great. I'm going to have to spend this time shipping stuff all over the place or whatever. Well, once again, you, you asked some excellent questions. I'm glad that you are on here because you are really thinking and you, uh, you ask excellent questions. So um, it's a pleasure to have you on here, JJ. Let, uh, let's log in. I'm going to show you my emails. So you can see how easy this is. Support at stack and sell. Boom, look at this. So 
you get notified instantaneously. They send you a text message and an email to let you know you've sold a coin because you've got 48 hours to get that thing uh, in the mail, okay? So hi, Sean, thanks for using Stack and Sell. We're happy to report that your item has sold. Um, and then it tells you the exact item number so that you can know which one, because obviously you're gonna have duplicates probably of some of these state coins. We're anxious to release to you your portion of the funds we've collected on your behalf. The next step is for you to safely send the items to us. You have 48 hours to safely get the item on the way. Items that are sent late are subject to a late item fee of $15. Please send the correct item. The serial number must be boom. Um, and then you're gonna send it to stack and sell. Attention ship, and then this is the actual shipping number for that particular item. So without them even having to open the package, they know exactly what coin is in there. And you're gonna ship it to Enterprise Street in Idaho Falls, Idaho. And uh, that's it. I mean, here's the support team. If you have questions, uh, you can what just- What was that last it. part that it said? It's hard to read that, it's small. What does that say? After we've received the item and it has passed inspection, you will immediately see a credit in your stack and sell balance, which is your sound money wallet. You may then request a disbursement via physical check, seven day processing, or you can put it uh, instant transfer for free to your sound money wallet. If you have questions about the process, simply reply to this email. And it was pretty simple to set up the um, sound money wallet with stack and sell so that those funds can be deposited. It um, is really simple and really easy. And I'll tell you what, the owners of 7K have been over backwards to accommodate us so that we have every opportunity to not only make our lives better, but more importantly, pay it forward. Let's help other people improve their lives and protect and secure their families with the best insurance that you can get, which is God's currency sound money which is a fancy name for precious metals gold and silver yeah amen yeah you you guys i'll tell you what this this was a great uh, uh, I, I really got a lot out of this one i'm excited about being able to utilize this because i've started investing in these coins i've got them arriving on my on my doorstep every month and then sometimes i'm even picking up some on coin drops and all that kind of stuff and I'm going to start learning how to get these all listed up onto the stack and sell. And maybe I'll get together with Sean and we'll uh, do a spe spe special training episode on how to put a put one on just for the fun of it as a bonus episode. Uh, maybe this week, because I'd like to start working on getting these things in there so I don't have to do 450 of them at once. And uh, so but next week, you guys, next week and and you guys, I think we're going to go with something a little different um, in that. Uh, We've been wanting to do these meetings on Monday to start the week off with a bang. But these next few weeks, this whole month of July has been a real trouble to try and do it on, on Monday. And so next week, I want to redo our next meeting, which is going to be about the sound money wallet. You guys, you're going to want to learn about the sound, sound money wallet. You get your coins, you put them on stack and sell. When it's time to liquidate, they go over into your sound money wallet. You'll eventually have a debit card that goes with that sound money wallet, and it's going to be cool as heck. We're going to get a chance to take a look, a close look at that next Tuesday. And um, so let's go with Tuesday next week. And uh, if that's, is that going to work for you, Sean? Sure. And let me, let me finish one last thing. I just want to go through. These are all the items that I have listed for sale. So I just want the average person who's listening is, is on this training to get an idea of what the potential is. So if we look at this Spider-Man coin that I've listed for 275, I bought that coin for 125. This Black Panther uh, for 250, I bought for $100. This Writer uh, Life of Franklin, this half ounce coin, I bought just six months ago for $119. And the market value is already 250 on that. Um, look at this life of Washington half ounce coin, $119. The market value on that is $350 right now. Why? Because it's a Miles Standish coin. And the Miles Standish coins are always going to be uh, rare. 
uh, scarce uh, mintage. So those coins are, are gonna go up in value. Once again, Life of Washington, another half ounce coin. I paid 119 for that coin. So I got several coins listed on here that when they sell, I'm gonna make a nice little profit. And um, if I can just keep doing this now, now that I've learned from my mistakes, you don't wanna just hold on to your collection, you know, uh, when you could be literally selling some of these coins for a quick instant profit, taking that money and buying the coin that you originally bought, take the profit, buy another coin. Now you've got two coins to sell. And then that could become four coins, eight coins, 16 coins, 32 coins. And before you know it, you're making two, maybe $3,000 a month in passive income, doing nothing more than sitting at your computer for maybe five minutes a day. So once again, folks, 7K Metals has unlimited opportunities for you and your family. And it's an unlimited way to protect yourself by saving, 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 not spending, not consuming, but saving and investing. And that's really what we're all about. We're trying to change Americans who have the worst consumer mentality in the world to becoming investors and savers. And there's no better way to do that than a hundred and some dollars a month for a silver collectible coin. I never in a million years could have guessed how amazing this company would become and what an impact it would have on me personally to help fix my life after all the problems I've had. Uh, this is a genuine godsend. And as are JJ and Leonard, my two friends that are a part of this business, um, that's the best part of this business is the quality of people that you get to spend your time with. So I'm incredibly yeah. thankful, JJ, Leonard, for your time to get on this call this morning and anybody that's gonna watch this, thank you for your time. And don't hesitate to contact anybody uh, that's a member with this group because we're all willing to pitch in and help no matter who you are. It's everybody wins scenario once you're on board. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. You guys keep in mind that when you're saving money in a bank, you're not actually saving money. You're losing, no, you're money. losing money. And, um, and if you, and it's if you don't understand that, let me know and I'll be happy to explain it to you. It's really quite simple. Um, but anyway, we're not going to get into that right here. But remember what you're doing, what, everything that Sean talked about in that last little sequence, you're, you're doing this with real money. Gold and silver is real money. And I want to reiterate to people that in the, in the U.S. National Federal Register, the dollar is still defined to this day as 371.25 grains of pure silver, which is one ounce of pure silver. It's never been removed. It's still there. What's gonna come crashing down kids is this, this piece of paper, this, yeah. this Federal Reserve note thing. That's what's gonna come crashing down. And quite frankly, that's a good thing because that thing needs to go onto the ash heaps of history and we need to return to sound money. And Bye -bye. I'm gonna, I'm going back to sound money, regardless of what the government's doing. And I'm doing it through 7K Metals. And I'm gonna be on a mission to get this sound quality information so people can, you know, our job, Sean Leonard, is to bring this information to people's attention. We're trying to do it in the most economical way that we can do it by making these videos so people can actually watch them when they have a few minutes and they can learn about how they can go back to the gold standard and why it's so dang important for them to think about that now. So that's why we're doing this. That's why we're gonna be jumping in every week for the next seven more weeks. And then we'll keep doing it after that with just different subjects and going deeper into smaller things about it all so that you guys can go to the Kong Family YouTube channel. You can click on the playlist. You can go to the 7K Metals playlist and you can watch all this stuff. You can send this stuff out to your people. This is all, all meant to uh, save not only our own butts, but everybody else's butts too. <laughs> so. Well, and, and honestly, JJ, it's one of the littlest things that you can do that's going to have the greatest impact or significance, uh, not just for yourself, but your entire family and then your children's children. This is... Uh, this is creating generational wealth, a legacy for you and your family. 
and nothing could be simpler, nothing could be easier. And, you know, it's just baby steps. There's nothing that's complicated about this. It's not difficult, it's not strenuous. And with technology and social media, it's pretty easy to share this opportunity with people who are out there looking, and especially with the economic times and inflation, uh, people are, are becoming desperate more and more each day, and people are looking for exactly what we have to offer. It's now our responsibility to get that information out there for people to look at it, and then it's up to them to decide, is this something that works for them? And if they have common sense, they're going to say, wow, this, this makes a lot of sense. As a matter of fact, it's a straight up no brainer. Yeah. You know, I got to say, I found out about this company um, on a Friday night and I joined in on that Friday night and uh, that's it. As soon as I saw this, I had to jump on the train. That's it. And the way I say it, see, it really is jumping in the boat. Because yep. there's a financial tsunami coming towards America, and uh, it's in the name of a giant swarm of Federal Reserve notes that are going to be losing. They're going to be toilet paper. Toilet you know, paper. My new hashtag is turn paper into gold. I might have to change it, turn toilet paper into there gold. There you go. <laughs> because that's where it's going to be. I think I'm going to change that hashtag, or maybe I'll just go with another one. But uh, yeah, um, you guys... Um, thanks so much for being here. And uh, to everybody that's viewing this video, thank you so much for taking your time. If you have any questions about, about any of this stuff, just reach out and we'll make sure to get you the information. It's easy enough to reach out just through the video itself once it's up on YouTube. And, uh, and you can just ask a question in there and we'll get back to you. We'll make sure we get your questions answered get you put on board with whoever it is that uh, invited you to watch this video in the first place. And, um, you know, we're all here as, as a, an amazing team of, of people who want to go back to the gold standard together. Excited of people. The government's doing. Yeah. So brother, you guys, brothers, I love you. Sure was great getting to meet you guys and give you guys a real hug last week. Yeah. So I just wish we could have spent more time together. Yeah. Well, I'm coming to Billings on the, 22nd 23rd so i'll see you guys this, up there here in this month of this month oh wow yeah we're going i'll be back looking up. forward to that we're going golfing because i haven't golfed once yet this year so. <laughs> i love it all right i'm, I'm going to stop this recording and uh everybody god bless and godspeed and do good and be good love you amen Woo! <laughs>